Hey YouTube, welcome back to a brand new Animal Crossing New Horizons video. Today we have some good news, finally we do have some information about the next update and even a bit more of a mysterious comment from Nintendo about the future of Animal Crossing. So without further ado, let's get straight into today's video. So we are of course at the end of all the content that was added in the most recent 1.10 update and we have for months now been waiting for any sign of a future update, what, uh, what's going to happen to New Horizons, no one has really known but finally today Nintendo have pretty much announced the next update in a tweet that basically just says a free update is coming to Animal Crossing New Horizons on July 29th and just to tell us to ensure we have the updated late to the latest version to get access to the upcoming fireworks festivals in August. We know this fireworks festival happens every Sunday so we knew this update was going to come this week but it seems that for the moment at least this update will only add the fireworks festival which we guessed and a few new seasonal items. So it's kind of the lesser side of the update that we were expecting we knew this would be the bare minimum but it's good news that it has arrived they haven't let us down and also which is really kind of unexpected i guess they followed up the tweet with another tweet saying in addition to these updates more free content for animal cross new horizons is currently in development for later this year more information will be shared in the future so please stay tuned thank you for your support and patience well this again is very mysterious but it does confirm animal cross new horizons is far from finished. We're probably talking about a fall update and most likely we will start to see new special characters like Brewster. I guess that's probably going to be what they're aiming for. I don't know if Nintendo had this plan originally or if this is based off community feedback but clearly they have something else in development and we will see it later in the year. We can now rest easy knowing we can enjoy the fireworks festival through uh, throughout August. Now just quickly we can add that we do know some of the items that will be available in the update thanks to the article on the Japanese website we will be getting some new handheld items at Aunt Red's lottery stand including cotton candy a popsicle and a new drink which is really awesome they look really great and fun so that's something else to look forward to and also some of these seasonal items we know about include an event for Obon which is said to be when the ancestors return and we'll be able to get two items for this event running from August uh, the 10th through to August 16th including the cucumber horse and the eggplant cow which is really exciting and furthermore we have a mid-autumn festival which again adds even more food items it looks like so there's lots more stuff to look forward to there they are also bringing back the grape harvest festival which is some of the returning items from last year so there is a lot to look forward to in this update of course it's only a few small items and we can also look forward to something else in towards the end of the year so probably in a couple of months time we're probably going to be talking around September October they could really be talking about the Halloween update so maybe the next content that's in development will come around Halloween that's what I would guess but from going from no news for months to having a bit of kind of positivity and and a statement from Nintendo actually acknowledging this and confirming this this is great news in a couple of days time we'll know even more about what this next update entails but it's really awesome to know something is coming so I think we can celebrate a little bit we can breathe a sigh of relief something new is on its way but what do you think about this news are you happy Nintendo finally acknowledged it and let us know or are you disappointed there's no trailer be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comments below anyway that pretty much wraps up this video of course i'd like to thank all of the patreon and channel members for supporting this content and helping me upload as regularly as i do i couldn't do it without you as always if you made it to the end of the video be sure to leave a like and comment update just to let me know you did that would be super awesome and be sure to include what content you would like to see in the next update later in the year i'd love to know anyway until next time have an amazing day stay safe and i'll see you in my next video peace